Unit 1. I wish to tell you a story. It's a very profound story. A story true, a story profound. I've got to get this right. If I don't get it right, you will think me dick. But I am not dick. I am the way. So listen. There is a way to be found perfect in the eyes of God in the Bible, in the New Testament. It is around the passage where Jesus tells us to love our enemy. He does so. We have to love our enemy. Whatever. Because God is love. And it's not all about us. It's very selfish to think it's all about you and any some random mortal who happens to think you're a twat is your arch nemesis satanic and minion. No, no. It's not the way it works, right? Anyway, got on the wrong side of a Pakistani when I was a pizza delivery boy trying to deliver a nice pepperoni and mushroom pizza, I like to think. At rapid velocity, as was my career move. And he punched me in the face. He punched me in the face because I lurched my car at them because they wouldn't move their car because they were all chilling out and gassing around their car when I was trying to get out of the space they were blocking. So I was like, you know, get out of my way. And he wouldn't get out of my way. So he got in my passenger seat and went, after a bit of a, bit of a lecture from a Pakistani in our, in our country. And I was outnumbered. I didn't know what to do. And at the time I was doing the Christian Alpha course. And also always was a fan of Arnie's Terminator. <coughs> and he punched me. I knew immediately what to do because I believed. I looked at him and I turned the other cheek. I didn't say a word. And I will never, ever forget the terror in his eyes. He went out, he got out of my car, the whole situation was precated, God was protecting me for faith and belief, and he wanted to be my friend for weeks afterwards. He would keep coming in when I was delivering pieces, trying to talk to me and learn from me. Keep it real, brothers of the Holy Spirit. We are not done yet.